Snipe Squad, what is going on? Back again, it is your boy Sniper Joan Joan. And I am back with another video for yeah, head top. What is going on, everybody? As y'all can see, I am up, I am ready, man. I am super excited. Today, we have one of the biggest sneakers of all time. One of the most iconic sneakers in Jordan brand history releasing. This Saturday, the Air Jordan Bread 11s is retro and for the hundredth time, but people are still feeling the vibe. Right now, man, smash that like button. Let's get this video to like 100,000 views, bro. We 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 going for the banger. That's, that's, on, that's on dog. Today, I am going to pick up, not only am I going to pick up the Bread 11s, I'm also going to pick up a pair of the Yeez Real. I asked you guys in my last video, bro. I said, if you want me to pick up the Adidas 350 Boost Yeez Real, then comment down below in the comment section. And guess what? Y'all said go get them. So you already know today I will be picking up both pair, bringing them back for the game. Also, guys, huge shout out to the two contested winners. I have been telling you guys for over a month now that me, Unbreakable, and my boy Flight did a giveaway where we were doing a giveaway for two pair of Air Jordan Bread 11s and we chose the winners. So shout out to B underscore Rose and shout out to I am three Giorgio. I guess it's supposed to be Giorgio or something like that. Now listen, man, you already know when the Bread 11s or when any 11 come out, the line is gonna be long as a month. So I can only imagine what today's vibe is about to be like. Now you know me, you know your boy Schneid Jones. I'm an in and out type of guy, you know what I'm saying? I gotta be in and out like a, like a robbery, bro. I ain't trying to be in no line all day. I ain't trying to be, you know what I'm saying? I I got I got to go come back home edit my videos and handle mine. So I'm going to be in and out. Right now it's like 9, 25, 9, 30. The mall that I'm going to opens up at 10 o'clock. And to be completely honest, I think they opened up before 10 o'clock, but I'm a 10 o'clock type of guy today. So hopefully we get some great footage. I know we're going to get some great footage, man. This is how I know we're going to get some great footage. Shout out to Mom Dukes, man. Mom Dukes called me. She was at work today. And she was driving to work and she said, son, why are all these people standing outside the street? Now, my mama don't know nothing about shoes, bro. When Mom Dukes hit me up and asked me why all these people standing outside, like, she did the same thing last year when the concourse dropped. So I'm like, you know what I'm saying? It's like 7 in the morning. I'm like, my look, okay? It's for the bread 11. But when Mom Dukes called, asking why people standing outside, it, it ain't for John Legend tickets, boy. It's for some J's. The J's, man. So shout out to everybody who hit today. Shout out to everybody who watching this video. If you ever watch the Jordan game or a highlight ever in your life, for this video, I'm gonna need you to smash that like button. Thank you guys so much for tuning in once again. <sighs> Let's get it. you guys i am outside of greenbrier mall about to go pick up my pairs it's cold it's it's windy look how windy it is out here bro it's cold it's windy i do have my microphone protector on so hopefully hopefully y'all boys can hear me man and it's not too windy up in here i'm excited bro i want to see what the lines is gonna look like i know 2020 2019 these are gonna be like the years of like no more lines because people don't really have to go through the most to get their shoes no more people can just pull up or buy online so it's been a while since i've seen like one of those long lines i talked about earlier in the video so actually i really hope i do see one just for like nostalgia purposes man i want to see like what the vibes is like i'm not seeing a line right now a foot action which is not good but you know you got until three o'clock so, i mean it is what it is for real foot action is right here the mall actually looks very very empty foot action is right here and I see no line. So probably people just going in and out, not really tripping. Now me personally, I hit both pairs at Foot Locker. I do see like a small line inside the store, but I'm used to them boys being like all the way, all the way outside the store. I'm not really used to them joints only being in the um, inside the inside the store. I'm used to them being wrapped around the store. But we'll see what the Foot Locker look like. Like I said, both pairs was at Foot Locker. Let's get it, man. You know what? While I got this quick time to talk, man, it looked like the mall done beefed up security. I don't know if it's because there's release, or I don't know if it's because holiday time and people get the sticky fingers whenever holiday time is around. Because y'all know when holiday time come through, people be acting crazy. But I might have to duck this camera a little bit more than usual because I see, like, 
Greenbrier, you know, they ain't got the most money, you know what I'm saying? But it look like they hire about five or six more of them guys, man. So, I think I'm trying to do is get kicked out the mall for recording and not being able to do my pickup. In and out like a robbery, man. Y'all know, y'all know the vibes, man. Y'all know the vibes. Hit that thumbs up button right now if you ever seen Jordan Hoop. All right, man. So right now I'm inside the mall and the line not looking half bad. Well, this is just like for the for the original joint. Like I said, usually they had the lines busting outside the stores. This time it's just decent in the in, inside the mall. Now, like I said, you get into like three o'clock to pick up your pair. So I know like a lot of people got. 20, 50 pairs to pick up, so I'm pretty sure everybody not in the same spot at once. But, you know, the line not too bad, you know what I'm saying? It is what it is. I do believe that this is a shoe that if anybody wanted it, you can get it, because it was not hard to get, you know what I'm saying? I had a few accounts that I hit pairs on, they just spread it out. I can't be everywhere, you know what I'm saying? I'm not really trying to drive around the world for them, because remember, I already did get a pair I hit on Snickers app, so, you know what I'm saying? I don't need four or five pairs. I got my car. All right, man, we out here at Greenbrier. You already know the vibes, boy. I'm with the homie Michael. Got the pair. Hey, Michael got his pair. I got my pair. I got the breads and I got the Yeezy joints, man. Tell them, tell them what we got going on today, man, bro. Just more wins, more wins. <laughs> I got my pair. My boy Snipe got his pair. Yes, sir. We just, we just win today. So, so shout out to the homie, man. He watched the channel, and it's always love, man. Something that I've seen, a lot of people is passing on the Yeezys, bro. What do you, what do you think about that? Everybody, don't know, nobody want the Yeezys? I ain't gonna lie. I looked at them. They're like, you're like, like you're walking on about some highlighters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like you're just highlighting. <laughs> now I asked them. Yeah, I now the only thing I was questionable about is the fact that you know they got the glow in the dark joints, mm -hmm. and then they got the uh, semi frozen that kind of looked uh, just like that one. So I, I wasn't sure. I hit on those and I sold them. Just they about anybody who wanted to get the bread eleven. You should have got them. Um, other than the app crashing, and they still on sneakers right now, and it's like so many. So, where, so. so are the Yeezys? The Yeezys? I, I don't know, the Yeezys bro. Yeezys still on Foot Locker. They're still they, they still sitting? Yeah. Jesus. I had some other pairs to pick up, but I'm too lazy, so I'm gonna just go back to the house and get this out. I catch up with y'all soon, man. We out. All right, y'all. We in the whip. Pairs are secure. Why is everybody sleeping on these Yeezys? Okay. I get the breads the bigger shoe. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to talk about this a little bit more when, I, more when I get home. By the way, man, shout out to homie in the video. Uh, a subscriber. Show love as soon as I walked in, man. That's what it's all about. Just showing love to the people that really, you know what I'm saying? Show love to you. Y'all think I'll be playing, man. Like, I don't mean to be super sentimental or, like, over, you know what I'm saying, overreacting. But when people acknowledge you, when people show love, bro, I fully accept that. Like, without y'all, this platform wouldn't be available. Videos, YouTube is, is simply... Like, in the simplest form, I put out videos you guys watch. Without you guys watching, my relevancy is nothing. So, anybody, if y'all see me, because a lot of times, like, when I go inside the mall, and the reason why I'm recording is because I just check my phone. I seen, like, five DMs of people like, yo, I seen you, but I didn't want to walk up. It's like, bro, I am super approachable. I thank y'all, like, so much. If you ever see me out, bro, like, it's cool. Like, it's, it's love, man. Trust me. Look like the Yeezys probably definitely like second fiddle probably like four fifth fiddle so it, it's something different for sure yeah man i'm about to take this back to the crib and i'm gonna give y'all just like a quick little rundown of of the day and uh some stuff that i seen today that, that was kind of surprising ah all right guys we are finally back at the crib back at the house man long day we we were actually it wasn't a long day all right we was in and out as promised so to cut all the riffraff here we have both of the pickups from today we have the air jordan bread 11s and of course we have that Yeezy 350 V2 Yeez Reel as well. So first off, the shoe we're gonna check out. Y'all know I usually wait till we get to the crib before I open up any boxes and show y'all what they look like or I get my first looks. But we already know what the Air Jordan Bread 11 look like. I already did a review on it. So you know, we just gonna check these out regardless. All right, so we get the, bow. The commotion, the hype, the never ending struggle. Crazy thing is these are still available right now on Sneakers app. Right now it's like 11 o'clock and they still have some sizes available. Now, doesn't mean that they're sitting nobody wants them. I just guarantee you it was that many pair. Um, I will be doing a video on these just saying like, if you didn't get these, bro, I don't know what you were doing. I don't know how you was doing it, but if you really wanted them and you actually like really tried, you could have got them, okay? So many out there. Um, It's gonna be a lot of unpicked up pairs. That's what I was wanting to tell you guys about too. A lot of pairs are gonna be not picked up because 
so many people want so many here in Atlanta it's so spaced out I doubt you get all of these because DTLR did something to where all you had to do was like give them a toy and you guarantee the pair so it, it was crazy they did a lot of clever things this year Christmas time man so a great Christmas shoe we have the Air Jordan Bread 11. You know what I'm saying? OG box. Y'all know the vibes, man. I did do a review on this shoe already, so if you want to check that out, I will link that down below. And, uh, man, that's pretty much it for the bread. But the shoe I've been wanting to see for a while is this Yeezy Boost, okay? The shoe that's on a back burner. The shoe nobody really cares about, it seems like, because, of course, you have an Air Jordan Bread 11. Now, Yeezy is doing its thing. As I told you guys in my last video, the um, actual word Yeezy is the most searched brand in the world right now. So it obviously shows that he has some relevancy. I think he was poking his chest out a little bit too much when he decided to drop these on the same day that Jordan decided to drop his Bread 11s because I uh, wasn't the smartest idea in the world because I mean, it's a cute shoe. But regardless, we're gonna check these out. As I said, I know these look like the freaking glows and they look like the semi-frozens, but I couldn't help myself. Ah, here we have the Yeezy Boost 350 V2 Yeezy Reel. Okay, so. <laughs> What's my thoughts on these, okay? My thoughts on these is exactly what I predicted. Very, very bright shoe, and I like it a lot. Um, I actually like this shoe more than the Semi Frozen because it has the same colorway, but it doesn't have that peanut butter gum sole. I was working with the peanut butter gum sole, you know what I'm saying? It wasn't the best, but I was working with it. I believe this one had like some 3M on the laces. I don't think they do though. Okay, no, they don't. I don't think they have 3M on the laces. Maybe I'm tripping. Um, the laces are like a different green in the actual shoe y'all know i'm gonna drop a review on this in the own foot as well so i'm not gonna get really too descriptive of it but um i'm gonna grab the semi frozen and they favor each other obviously you know they favor each other a lot and uh one thing i can say about the uh semi frozen do have like a little bit more character because of that but i'm a simple guy simple basic i think this shoe is easier to rock easier to wear it's just you know this vault in black I actually even got the same back tabs too they both got like that same orangish dotted line back tab i don't know if the camera gonna focus there we go yeah they both got like that same back tab right there so it's a lot of similarities between these two shoes you don't really need both all right i'm just wasting money at this point you don't really need both so my question is who actually picked up these i know everybody pretty much picked up the bread 11s but who still went out and got the yeast reels everybody in line i know was just going for bridge so i won't be surprised if these joints sitting uh honestly it's it's crazy to say because this is a, a dope colorway, but I don't know. It just was not priority today. Regardless, man, like I said, I'm happy I picked up my pair. I thank you guys who tell me to pick them up. You know, thank y'all for voting and let me know what the vibes is like. And that's pretty much it for today's video, man. It's been wild, a wild day. Hopefully, everybody is safe out there getting shoes. A lot of crazy stuff happening out here in the world. The last thing I want is somebody to be hurt for a pair of shoes. At the end of the day, they're just shoes. And that's it, man. If you are new to the channel, subscribe because we're trying to hit 100,000. So let's hit that mark as soon as we possibly can. Make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter. That is always linked down below. Shout out to the contested winners. And that's just about it for me today, man. I will catch y'all next time, man. You know I cannot leave without saying everybody want to be famous. But we're really putting in that work, though. Snipe Squad, I love y'all. Dream big.